Hello and welcome to Vistra Walkthrough. Start creating high converting video pages, video funnels, and full blown video stores in minutes. Now let's get you started. We're going to create a video page. So first click on create pages and enter your desired page name. I'm going with Vistra and click on create. Okay, on the next page, you um, let's enable the headline option and insert my text right here. All right, so I'm going to just adjust this. You can edit it to suit your preference, really. So I'm going to adjust the heading to make it a bit bigger. And then I want to change the color of this portion of the text. Let's see. We can change it to, okay, this yellow looks good. Make it bold. Okay, that's great. I think I also want to change this portion of the text to a different color. So first, let's make it bold and choose um, a color. And no, I think blue. Okay, blue works better. That's great. Awesome. All right, so I think I want to adjust the heading. Let's make it this. Okay, that's perfect. Everything's looking great. Once you're done with the headline, you can now move to the body. Let's enable the body and insert my text right here. And just go ahead and edit just like we did with the headline. I'm going to center this. All right, perfect. It looks good. And I think I'm done with the body. Now we can move to add video. I'm going to use a link to a YouTube video. And that's it right there. Now let's edit the call to action button. Okay, I'm going to change the text to get instant access to Vistra. Okay, that works fine. Let's increase the font a little bit. Perfect. Now, what next? I think I want to change the button background to a different color. Let's go with this bright blue. Perfect. Now, the link type, let's stick with button and attach a link. This is where I want my visitors redirected. Okay, so the button position, let's center it. And I think everything is good with the button. All right, let's turn this off and move to adding a countdown timer. Okay, there it is. So let's separate the styles. That looks good. I think I'm okay with that. And now I'm going to add my lead form so I can gather my leads. Let's go with um, email only because that's what I want to gather. And then hit save. Perfect. Everything looks good. And let's try to open it. Awesome, that's my video page created successfully. All right, now let's create a video funnel. Once again, click on create funnel and enter your funnel name. I'm sticking with Vistra and then click on next. All right, as you can see, there's a number of themes you can choose from. Let's preview this. This is what it looks like, it's good. But first let's create from scratch. The three options, let's click add step, it appears, then add lead form, you can see it right there, and finally add call to action, that's the CTA. Next, I'm going to just arrange these nodes, and then we're going to connect to them by clicking on the arrow right here and dragging it to the next one. You can repeat the same, just like that. Now let's go ahead and edit each step of my funnel. Okay, so I'm going to add a heading. Let's go with win a copy of this draft when you sign up. Let's see, sign up today. Okay, that looks good. Now just go ahead and edit it just the way you want. I want to adjust the heading right here. All right, then I think I'm going to make it bold. And then let's change um, the color of this portion. Okay, I like this. All right, that's good, that's good. And we can move on to add video. I'm going with the link from my YouTube video. That's great. You can also add an image if you want. And then let's go straight ahead to the call to action buttons. For the first, I'm going to use um, sign up. 
and then for the second let's go with um, watch a demo perfect okay everything is looking good so finally I'm going to set the default correlation to lead form 1 and that's it you can hit save and close so let's move over as you can see it's marked green let's move over to lead form so for the lead type I'm going with email only so now let's add a heading enter your email below to claim it so go ahead and edit it once again I'm going to adjust the heading type okay let's see I'm going to change the color of this particular text to this okay that looks good you can add a video or an image but let's go ahead and enable the terms and conditions as you can see they appear right there you can also enable the GDPR with how it appears right there and once you're done just hit the save and close we're almost done so finally we go to the call to action let's edit that add a suitable heading I'm going with click the button below to get access okay let's go with click the button below to download okay that's much better and we're going to go ahead and adjust that so just in the heading type let's see I'm going to make this a different color all right that looks good you can add a video or add an image I'm going straight to the call to action button link type I'm sticking with button and then the link and hit save and close that's good okay so next we're going to click over to add theme right there and there are a bunch of themes you can use but I think I like this mustardy yellow one so let's go for that select theme and finally hit publish and there it is your video funnel is ready and it works great too as you can see that looks awesome all right now I'm going to embed my funnel into my site and there's various ways you can do this you can get a hosted link to your funnel just copy the link and open it on a new tab just like so right there there it is your video funnel it's right there so you can do that, you can get a hosted link to the funnel or you could add your funnel as a pop-up on your site. Just copy the link once again and paste it on the custom scripts of your page settings. Save that and okay, it's saved now. So once you open your site, your funnel should appear as a pop-up on your site. Right there, okay, that's awesome. You can see your funnel as a pop-up on your site or you could also add your funnel as say okay an announcement bar all right we can adjust the color of the bar I think I want to go with um, let's see okay red looks good let's okay make it a bright red then copy the link once again and paste on the custom scripts of your page settings Make sure you save that. Okay, it's saved and as you can see, it appears right there as an announcement bar on your site. That is perfect. So thank you for watching this video. That is how you use Vistra to create a video page or a video funnel.